When it comes to my next guest, you don't need an introduction. If you've watched Eurovision this year in Turin, which has been controversial in the voting system at the very end, I predicted in the top five this young lady from Greece because I felt it was Greece's strongest entry in many, many years. And if the sound was right, and if the production was right, she would be portrayed and the song strongly and would be up there in the top five. She competed, she did exceptionally well. Her stage performance was, was amazing. The voting was exciting because Greece was up there getting plenty of 12 points. So congratulations, Amanda Tenfjord, because in front of a couple of hundred million people, you really displayed the persona, the lyrical prowess, and you had a great stage presence. To the world, you, you, you've done that, you've cemented that. So I'm going back now and I'm taking, I've done my reaction, please check that out to Amanda, my prediction for, for the Eurovision of this year, but it's gone now and we need to go forward. But sometimes to go forward, you need to go back musically. And I'm going back in Amanda's career to Man of Ireland, to Man of Ireland, to Man of Iron, um, that she had written around 2017 and released but we need to go back to go forward with this young lady to catch up. And that's, a, that's only to give you, the people who are listening, a chance to catch up as well, because she is going to be in her own right. She has proved she can sing live. She's got a great stage presence. She's got a wonderful innocence about her. She was so enthused when she got the 12. She was thank you, thank you. And she was so enjoying the moment. And congratulations. Sometimes it's not about taking the title in a show. You'd be recognized for the personality and the persona of what you're about would shine through. And that's exactly what you've done for yourself, Amanda. So as I say in Spanish, felicidades. So I don't know how to say congratulations in the Greek language, but I will learn. I will learn. But just to let everybody know in advance, I've got itchy ears. Somebody must be talking about me and it must be a good thing because my channel is growing. Please like, comment and subscribe. And it's doing very well. And I, I, I've got gotten over 500,000 views since January and I'm heading towards 620, heading towards, I'm just looking, 632 at the moment. For what it's worth, it's growing and heading towards a million. So I, I can't wait. I want a million views and 10,000 subscribers. So I need more Greek people to join me. But back to Amanda, who is she? Let's give a little recap to those people outside Greece who don't know this young lady. As I said, she is Amanda Clara Georgius Tiamford and is a Greek, half Greek and half Norwegian singer and songwriter. And she represented, as I said, Greece in the Eurovision Song Contest 2022 this year with Die Together. Fabulous song. Please check out my reaction on my channel. You know, Tenford was born in, I hope I pronounced these places right, Alessand Moor Og Romsdal to a Norwegian mother and Greek father. And she lived the first years in Inania, I hope I've said that right. And it's often called Ar Yania within Greece, Yania within Greece. And it's the capital and largest city of the region. Now, then she moved to Tenfjord in Norway and where she was in, in the same glass class as Sigrid Singer. Wow. She's always blocked on my channel. I can't get that young lady to come on my channel because all her videos are blocked. And it was so frustrating after, you know, when you record a video and you hope that when you download it, it's not blocked and then it's blocked, you're like, no, but that's unfortunately what happened. And the record company came back and more or less said they didn't want it on my channel. So hopefully this won't be the case with Amanda's previous, I'm hoping with this particular track that this won't happen because I deserve to promote these young ladies. This is what my channel is about. It's a worldwide channel. All my videos are in over 16 languages 
to appeal to a mass audience around the world, representing artists and performers from around the world, everywhere from Poland to Ireland to America to Canada, everywhere. And what my channel is about is giving a voice to underrated artists that deserve a voice and deserve to have their music reacted to. So that's my job to give you a bio, a background of the song, and my interpretation of the lyrics. I never interrupt the videos. I won't be interrupting this one. But afterwards, I'll give you my interpretation of what I think the song is about. Now, as I said, she went on to study in the Norwegian University of Science and Technology, or Amanda, and she announced that she had put her studies on hold to focus on a musical career. And when you've heard this song, you will know why. Let's take it away. Links and other links to her always in the description, as always. Amanda, welcome back to my channel. I told all your fans that I would be, and the Greek people, that I would be showcasing you throughout 2022. And this is the start of my showcasing you going back in your career to move forward. So let's take it away with with Man of Iron. I walked this road a hundred times before into the woods, into the fire. Believed your lies too many times before It was a fault based on desire But now I know that we ain't going back no more Cause all these fairy tales are all distracting us Oh, man of iron, show me the road The road out of the storm Man of iron, show the road out of the storm that I always say that about a lot of artists I bring onto my channel because they do produce the most incredible music and even though that was a couple of years ago that is so current now Amanda your music that people will go back to this music to play currently now I think you're an incredible musical find to come onto my channel and I'm so proud to have supported you for Eurovision seen the wonderful performance you had 
and seen so many countries give you 12 points justifiably so and now you get 12 points for this man of iron has a very norwegian influence folk type influence about it this particular track i felt that i felt it was almost norwegian your your roots are coming through and there's a norwegian flair i i don't know where it was filmed but the forestry was stunningly beautiful answers in, in the comments please if you know i just love your voice i love your personality that shone through um, very much in Eurovision again, but it comes through in your voice, it comes through in your confident delivery of that song. Simplistic it might be in lyrics, it's beautifully harmonized with the music, beautifully harmonized. It's the kind of music, this meditation music, relaxing music, the kind of music if you were in a car, you would just honestly, float away and and you get from A to B with that beautiful music in your ears very relaxed I just love everything musically about you and that's what I am a musical reactor I react to the music more so than I have to the the actual lyrics talking of which let's get going with the lyrics now of Amanda's incredible song and I have them in front of me it starts, I've walked this road a hundred times before, into the woods, into the fire, believed your lies too many times before. It was a fault based on desire. So she's analyzing a situation in a relationship that I think many, many people out there are going to be analyzing and saying, Amanda, I'm with you on this one. How many times, including myself, have we been in a situation where we've walked forward in a relationship and walked the same old walk, the same, put on the same old boots, done the same old thing and just wanted something special with the person that you're with, for it to be different than before, for you not to walk the same walk and do the same talk. And because you want it so much, because you believe it so much, what comes out of the person's mouth? You just accept, swallow, listen to, emotionally absorb inside, and you just believe whatever they tell you, whatever they want, because you just want, instead of being alone, you want to be with somebody. Your need to be with somebody overrides your common sense almost in your head so she and that's what happens here in in the opening she's admitting it was a fault based on desire when you're sexually attracted to somebody that tends to flower the situation in your head and it, instead of a bed of roses it should really you should be looking at a bed of thorns from what this particular opening verse has said now she goes on to the pre-chorus, but now I know that we ain't going back no more because all these fairy tales are all distracting us. <clears throat> fairy tales come from both sides and she's admitting that everything this person said to her, the desire to want them, anything he had said, she just believed and just, I, maybe he said, I loved you, I want you, I desire you. And you're like, yeah, yeah great great that's what I want to hear and you're just believing it and yet there's no texts there's no emails there's no contact there's no follow-throughs it's when you're together you're together and then when they're away they're away and it's like you don't exist it's like they have their life you're included but you're not included emotionally if that makes sense so she just believed it'll get better it'll get better so they're the fairy tales and she was distracted by the want and and the need for it to happen rather than the reality that it ain't going to happen. And it, the chorus, Man of Iron, show me the road, show me the road out of the storm. Man of Iron, show me the road, show me the road out of the storm. So we get to understand what Man of Iron means in this song. If you're a real man of words and a real man that takes charge, not just of your own life, of a situation 
that you're involved in, and, and in this case herself and this person, if you're a real man, you know, because we all think of like this for a man of iron, be that strong. Let me lean on you. I need your strength in this. I, I need your guidance in this. Be the man. You wear the boots. You walk the walk. I'll walk with you, but show me that we're going to walk together. And that's what Man of Iron seems to be about. Because verse 2 says, I spotted you standing all alone among the crowd. You look proud. I assure you, darling, there's no absolution. It's all illusion. So powerful, so beautifully and poetically put, but very powerful. So in other words, he was an ordinary guy, overlooked, and she thought there was something special about him. So she, he noticed her she, noticing him, it emerged, obviously, and he, he seemed in the beginning to be so proud to be recognized and so, but what happens in, in a situation like that is when, when somebody isn't recognized and somebody takes notice of them and it develops into a friendship stroke semi-relationship at this stage, there's no absolution from the fact that he is what he is, I am what I am. It started out because I put the effort in, which she did. I took notice of him and he seemed very happy with that. And But then she, there was the expectancy from that. And she, as she said, it's all an illusion. From noticing him and him noticing her and things developing, she had this illusion. It would just, he would sweep her off her feet like the man of iron and just show her the way forward and they'd live happily ever after. But as it continues, but now I know that we ain't going back anymore because all these fairy tales are all distracting us. In other words, what she hoped in the beginning didn't materialize. What she hoped would develop wasn't developing and what she hoped for the future that instead of her putting so much effort of herself into it he would do something didn't happen and she continues man of iron show me the road out of the storm show me the road out of the storm and continues storm out of the storm storm out of the storm storm out of the storm now for me storm out of the storm is a build-up of frustration her anger, her upsets, her tears, that's the storm, the rage. That's my advice to you if you're in that situation. So wonderful, wonderful song. Well done, Amanda. Another fabulous song. Looking forward throughout 2022 featuring you again. Man of Iron, one of my favorites so far. I'm going to create a very special thumbnail to attract people to this video because they need to hear your music. And I love doing that. I love being creative with my thumbnails. From the video, I'll create a really good thumbnail for you. And hello to all the Greek people again. It's in your language. Please check the tra uh, auto translate. And it's also in, if you're from anywhere else in the world, click on that auto translate. It's in over 16 languages, this video. And I look forward to you subscribing for all my efforts. Ching, ching. Take care, Greece. Take care, the world. And thank you, Amanda great listening to more of your music and i hope you agree too check her out on the musical link attached to this video in the description below take care